And wait, one, two, oh, three. That was so awful. What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the Boss Bus Podcast. Episode Today, two. Episode two. <laughs> today we have a very special we guest. We have a very special guest today, and I hope that you can hear this clearly. And it is a mystery. I wonder who you could have guessed. Was it Elon Musk? Was it George H.W. Bush? Oh, that drumming on the table. Was it Obama? That's Was it Osama? Actually, it is... Come on in, Nelson Mandela. Get on in. Hi guys, I'm I squeezed past uh, a very thick boy. That's um, where I gotta be, guys. I gotta go. No, you look <laughs> sick right now. <laughs> yeah. I should leave like now. <laughs> your eyes, your eyes are terrifying. So let's. Welcome go. everybody. Welcome Stormy. Yeah. What's up, dude? Yeah, Stormy. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> well, Thanks, who, man. Is the, who is who hey, is this guy? Who are you? Uh, I was just hanging out yeah. on 90th the Maple. Trying to get some what the fuck he is made the maple? Is that it's, uh, coordinates? It's, it's, it's is that where you live? Is it a mall? That's a mall? Technically. I live in the forest. Is that, a, is that a significant spot to you? Did you, did you do something on the 90th and Maple? I killed a man there home? once, but you know, that's all about territory. All right. And welcome Stormy no. Lynn Scott <laughs> Hello. to the table. Stormy, Stormy name. last oh, name yeah. Lynn Scott. <laughs> he is a. Water? I don't want to suck your nose. Do that. This, this man. man is a rapper. This man is a songwriter, a singer in some sense, in a good way. He is a writer. Yeah, he is a rapper. A he has written a lot, and he has really grown a lot as a producer and as a professional. Mm. So we are glad to have him. And he smokes a ton of crack. Stormy Linscott. Thank you so much. <laughs> Do you have anything that you want to plug? Like um, a SoundCloud? I have okay. a SoundCloud that uh, I just give out to local <laughs> church groups. Yeah. Yeah, church groups only. I could church groups only. I mean, like, yeah, you know, they really appreciate the content and the movement. You know, yeah. I could have just not done the whole. I really like the protests. You know, I really like the signs. You know, yeah. you will go to hell. It gives me a lot of inspiration. Yeah. Non-transmutation. I believe yeah. in that shit, man. Yeah. Um. No, that's a, that's a so, uh, theory. And Stormy, the songwriter, the writer, the rapper himself, August yeah. Kingswood. Nope. What does that mean to you? What made? Are you, you narrowing me right now? Are you no, pulling a nerd war right now? August King. Are you thinking things, things from your past? Shut the fuck. Okay. What what made you think of your first? So these are real things. So That's like, so on a real note, oh What made you think God. of August Kingswood as your first rap? You, I want to you know. know why. You know. No, why. I actually don't. What the fuck? It were, were, wait. Right. When were you born? Uh, I was born in 1990 in Atlanta, Georgia. What? No, no, no. When? August. I, no, in June actually. Okay, never mind. I like okay, the fall continue. though. I don't know I, when. I like the fall <laughs> probably because of my birthday is in June, so I always have you know June is like hot to me. But I like the fall because it's cool, you know. So August Kingswood is actually came from like the street name I saw when I was growing up and. Uh, uh, I did see a post on that. Yeah. August Kingswood. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I actually like. Uh, yeah. So I got the name because I started writing and I just wanted to go by Stormy because there's a rapper from the UK named Stormzy. Bless you. <laughs> and I didn't want to go by Stormy at first, but uh, you know, as I got older, I thought August King was too long of a name. August King, and I was like, none of my name has a G in it. I mean, my first name's Austin, by the way. So if you're curious about it, my yeah. first name's Austin. Oh yeah, I, I meant to call you by your full legal name. You were gonna way. do it, weren't you? No, I yeah. forgot. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot <laughs> it was forget. Austin at first. I for, I knew it was an A, but Cracking that's beer. actually really interesting. I thought August King's would was dope to be. No. To be real, I thought for honestly, I thought no. I wasn't sure what it meant. I didn't like it because it represented, uh, dark, like I don't know, street I, names. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> wasn't it? Street name. well, wasn't, it? wasn't it? No, it was a it was it was a name I tried to go by, but it was only on a YouTube video that I did. Well, no, a street video. name didn't it come from the street? Uh, Reese, Reese is now climbing. Under Reese the is gone. Table. Um, <laughs> Honestly, if anything, he wanted to take a little nap. So, 
<laughs> just like this, okay? Yeah, that's fine. He's actually, uh, he's uh, actually so on my toes right now. One of the cheeks, we had three cheeks that were pushing between Stormy, and if anything, one of the weights is now weirdly alleviated. He's so. <laughs> <laughs> he's coming yeah. back. Who's being birthed? Ow. He's climbing. Ow. 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 You have back. a fucking camel back. <laughs> you don't hit the table. That's gonna. You're giving everybody with headphones. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to hear. <laughs> everybody, yeah, right. yeah. Right. We cheese. can't touch this table. <laughs> All right. Um. How are you no, doing? No. What I was saying. <laughs> how you doing, dude? <laughs> Drink your water. I am so good, guys. Yeah? Um, I'm glad you're good. Three, so um, I've been very into meditation. I like okay. August. Okay, is that where you went off to? I liked August King's To meditate? But what made you... So this is about... Let's not talk about August King's. What's no, exactly. Up? I like that, but regardless. What did you do on my feet? What did you do on my feet? What were you doing? Your feet? Yeah, were you rubbing them? Well, by the way... I think rub is a very over-encompassing term. Okay. Um, yeah, what's the rub? rub so like, rub would be like a very, a very, um... It's almost like a culturalistic thing, you know? Like, yeah, I could rub this on your back, right? It's a little salve, or, you know, I'm rubbing this, this on this chicken. It's some salt and some fish, right? <laughs> um, I wouldn't classify it as much as a rub as I would as, like, a... And I know, you know, we all toss these kind of words around. I would say a miracle. <laughs> and don't you don't need to listen. Oh, you make me sick. Listen. Oh, Listen God. to me. You smell like Crawford. Listen to me when I talk <laughs> to you. Like I smell like Gretna. Oh, come on. That, that's a whole town. That's <laughs> me. No one lives in Crossroads. <laughs> no one lives in Crossroads. That's me. Be careful. Listeners. Imagine a headphone. No. No. Smell me. Imagine a headphone user, dude. I would yeah. be so sad. <laughs> that was uh, that was. I would hate it. I would be like, "Ow! Why would you do that?" <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of like. That's too. Me. This is definitely uh, some you're workout. You're like, put your arms off the table. We can edit this out. I hope. We don't need to edit any of this out. We can't, dude. It, it's okay. Dude. So you're raw. Yeah. I've covered raw. a few things. Content. <laughs> So, we've covered a few things. Let's recap where we were since we were from the... Last, give me one second. Let me, let's recap where we were from the last session. So, we did release merch. Okay, And this is really dope. So, teespring.com slash stores slash the branded bus. The dash branded dash bus. So, if you want to get where Reese is at, if you want to get on his level... On the low low... Wait, we have, please don't hit the table. We have <laughs> leggings, we have long sleeve tank tops. Or you can turn them into tank tops. They're actually long sleeve shirts, crop top tank tops, whatever you need. We have shirts, we have hoodies. We also have beach towels for your summer needs. So I would like to thank our sponsors today, uh, the Branded Bus, as well as Anchor, as well as any of the other podcasts that will be mentioned right during this commercial break. So thank you guys. We will return with more questions for Stormy and also our question and answer segment. God bless New Jersey. And we're back with another Boss Bus <laughs> segment. So let's hear it. Thank you to our sponsors for today. We appreciate everything you guys do. Again, like we said, if you want to go and check out teespring.com slash stores slash the dash branded dash bus uh, use code bussy it will only be active for two Ooh. weeks actually b-u-s-s-y you will get 10% off your purchase I'm not kidding we made that that's really real that happens yeah, good. so please do it 10% off discount so we appreciate everything you guys have done and storming yep what's up man where do you get your inspiration <laughs> jumping all right, we're jumping. Uh, my inspiration, uh, I don't know, man. Uh, probably just, I don't know, just doing a bunch of bad shit. You know, it's like growing up and stuff and hanging out with these guys. I mean, like, they didn't do the bad, bad stuff. They were the good kids that I hung out with. And they thought they were bad for just smoking and stuff, you know. But I used to do, like, really bad shit, you know. It was just the, <laughs> what kind of bad shit? I mean, like, stealing from, like, I'm, I'm not going to say Like that. department like, stores. Bad Whoa. stuff. I mean, I, I was doing bad shit, but, you know, and I eventually got on probation, and I actually met Zach and Reese, like, right before I got on probation. And then I was on probation, and I actually didn't talk to them for, like, a year and a half because, like, I didn't talk to anybody. 
but you know, I was on house arrest for like a year and a half with him. Yeah, I mean, maybe maybe like a year, but it sucked. You know, I didn't, lost a lot of friends, but I don't know. I get my inspiration from like in isolation, I guess, like being like alone, and, like letting your thoughts, you know, kind of like run and shit. So a lot of my stuff is kind of freestyle, unedited. Um, so yeah, that's where, shit, so yeah. that's where, yeah, I actually did shit right now. Honestly, that no, that makes a lot of sense. There's there is something to going through that type of thing, like especially something as long as a probationary period would be, and also it's, isolating yourself, dude. Well, that's just tough. It was more of like a self discovery kind of thing. So that's where like you know a lot of my music is like kind of I look back on it and there's a progression, you know, and that's same thing with any music and any artist, you know. You've grown a lot. Thanks. I mean. You got to. In a good way. You, you were mean, good at the beginning, but still. Yeah, I mean, like, you got to with music, especially keeping up. So, like, you know, I feel like my light is actually, like, shining out because, like, I'm only 21, but still, like, that's so young to a lot of people. But in the music industry for rap, especially with, like, talent and stuff, you got to, like, shoot quick. Like, you, you have, you've already had to have a following when you're 18. What's easy is, like, you know, when you feel like Omaha, you know, it's so diverse that like, you can't really I can't, I've never really been able to fit into a group, so like my music has really just always been progressing, and eventually it's going to get to a point where I'll be really consistent. But um, it takes I just, time. I mean, you know, lately I I've just been doing it in say you know like I don't know like every like two months or three months I'll I'll release a new song, but I eventually want to get to a point where I want to release more. But I see other artists doing more and more, and it makes me want to do. So, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, especially in, like, how competitive the music industry today, the doors have opened up to the bedroom producer now, like, with yeah. streaming services. Pro and, and that's the thing, producing, like, that's another music. thing, that, that, that's a key, like, if you want to be, a, a, like, a DIY, like, kind of, like, artist, like, producing mm -hmm. and rapping and, like, writing is, like, basically like, the only thing you really need to get a following, because if you have that un under your belt and you, you can show people write a song and produce a beat that's like magic to them nowadays like most people can't play a fucking guitar i can't play guitar i can't play guitar but he can I wish you know I could. but that's something exactly. like one in three guys can play a guitar and that's like crazy to think about it but like you know nowadays like it's crazy to hear someone playing a guitar good but like back in like our parents day like everybody played the guitar so <laughs> everybody did something like trumpet my, yeah, my some did. kind of like academic but, like nowadays people just want to play video games and fucking smoke <laughs> you know, yeah, they do. Honestly. I mean, and like that's what sucks. Like, as, 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 as an artist, I wish I, like, in my free time, I wanted to just, just write. But lately, I just been smoking and playing video games and working at my job. But like, dude, we've also been on like supreme lockdown too. Ex you, like, that's another thing is that, that it, it, it should, it, it should, thr it, should, it should make you want to do better and like really, really invest in yourself and take time with yourself and look back at like on what you're doing wrong. With me, I'm kind of just like at a standstill because I can't go to a studio. All I can do is write, but I'm feeling like, what is this going to be worth if I can write all this shit, but I can't have anywhere to produce, but I mean, until to like, it's right here. this microphone on this pile of rocks. We got, hey, we got things, dude, hey. I mean, okay, that, that sounded a little mean. I could. I mean, it's it's a whoop rocks, it's whoop rocks. If, if, like, mm -hmm. if you were to play a beat right now, I, I, I would rap a little It beat. will happen. Actually, surprise, guys. Oh. If you truly have a proclivity towards art, yeah. experience will not hinder said proclivity. So, if you find sense in the insensible, if you find meaning in certain pieces of art because that pain emulates a certain pain that you felt, that is a certain part of passion and understanding that you have derived from somebody else's architecture. And in that <laughs> That last part, no, that last part is true. That the was good. Was a little was, weird, but the, yeah, yeah, you're right. You, the the, you do, you do. The develop. pause was good. I <laughs> like the pause. It was needed, it was needed. Um, however, the boss pause. <laughs> something that I want to announce to everybody that is still listening right now. So, um, this is something that's going to be months down the line. We mentioned it in our last podcast, and we will not mention it again. We are a record label. Bus Republic Records encompasses the Boss Bus as well as the Boss Bus. Now that is two different <laughs> artists 
The Boss Bus is us. The Boss Bus is all of our collaborations with different artists and everything else that we could imagine and more. And now, we will see ourselves in court for copyright infringement. And we will. Similar. No, it will. Yeah, we will. We will. I will actually sue us and we will get damages and it'll be fantastic. How is we actually not? Asshole is Odin. there what any the fuck just was that? Me now. What was that segment? Jesus you know? fucking Christ. <laughs> We're calling people out. Yep. <laughs> hey, like, please, for the love of fuck. We need you. <laughs> you two people, please. Don't hit us. Don't. We need you. Not now. Not <laughs> now. You will end up in Zach's basement. In four <laughs> months. Please call me back. <laughs> this is a cool thing, not a desperate yeah, it's cool. cry for <laughs> help, you know? It's a cool thing. <laughs> It was meant to be cool. This is cool. This is cool. Did I cry for help? I know cool is. I'm cool. Did I portray it wrong? This is so cool. Did I portray things wrong? Did I say things incorrectly? I meant it to be a cool secret spy. Hit us up soon. There's no fucking. I spell anyway Z with a Z. Okay. By the way, if it's you subscribe on our Patreon for like ten bucks a month, what yeah. is it? You get pictures uh, of those feet without. Yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. So. yeah. Hold on. You I'm gonna almost, almost. No, no. Almost. 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 Look at this heel. Ooh. We're gonna zoom in this in post. I will. It's so right. I will. I will zoom in this in yeah, post. Give you a little wetness to it. Yep. You can tell he uses no, one wet. of those like yeah. cheese graters on his foot. Yep. Low wet. Low wet. Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at that. What the fuck is? You want the whole thing? Wrong with you? <laughs> I have <laughs> fucking <laughs> beer on me and my fucking dog. You fucking Satan. What the, what the fuck are you Damn, about? Dude, what are you? <laughs> Fucking crazy. What would you pour that much beer on a person? <laughs> Fuck. Y'all listen to that one. You to uh, watch that one on YouTube. Yeah, if you're still listening, type 69 in the chat. Uh, 69 beer pussy, hashtag. Bus. I hope to fucking God this never gets posted. <laughs> It's recorded it's right now, and I'm gonna airdrop it to myself in like a minute. Uh, Damn, I posted that on my story. <laughs> you did no, with that fucking potato. This is gonna be everywhere. <laughs> this is on all platforms tomorrow at fucking like 6 or 7 p.m. What do you mean? Behind the scenes. Jesus <laughs> fuck. I'll leave that foot. No, the foot wetted. Good, that's Patreon. <laughs> that's clickbait. I'm gonna put the thumbnail as Reese's foot. Like oh, with beer porn. Yeah, yeah, with beer porn. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna Potential sponsor, proper 12. Hey, Reese, you still need this. Distilled this age in Ireland. Uh, proper. Please. Conor McGregor, please sponsor us. I'm done. Please do. Yeah, please do. Pro give me a proper 12. He's got a proper sorting. <laughs> He'll beat your He's gonna go to the gulag. <laughs> I'm just thinking gulag. Yeah, the gulag. The gulag. The gulag. Um, however, this, now, it's let me check the time, because I feel like we're at... Uh, Ooh! That was good. 
10 minutes out from viewer questions, which means it is time for Stormy. Pick that beat. Oh, shit, Pete. Pick that beat. Uh, yeah, pick a beat. Well, what are we down here? We're going to get freestyle rap. Get computer freestyle over here. rap. Let's get Stormy. computer over here. It's another guitar. Turn it up a little bit, but like we need to move it back away from the mic where it won't like hurt it. I don't want to hurt people's ears. So I'm just staring at Alright, so what we're doing right now, Drew. Well, I mean. Stormy's got to pick a beat then, because I'm at a loss. He doesn't like that <laughs> music. I just keep skipping the fucking beat. All right. I don't even want to do a beat, dude. Let's just talk about Reese right now, dude. I think he's, I think he's making out with his dog. Here we go. <coughs> Sounds like Mario Kart. Better race. It's like a bowl of noodles. I, I like it. It's like a bowl of um, noodles. Yeah, let's talk about that I bowl like noodle neck. Let's talk about that noodle neck. Go strong, man. Not like his noodle neck. He's not in the freestyle and mood. I can take that noodle neck, Stormy. Uh, I'll take it. I'll take this freestyle if you don't want it. And it's too so like a bowl of noodles. I hang around some big dogs who hang around like half cool poodles. I have Drew Doodle with this fucking stupid pen. Please, I'm Luca Div with the fucking sense. In the sense that I'm too drunk and I'm not making sense, okay? Blacked out on a Thursday. Whatever dog I'm off of the Duce. Uh. <laughs> that's what, that's all, that's all the best you're gonna get out of me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do say in my pussy and I get it. I get it wet like I spit it. I stick it in my coochie and my boost. Yeah, I feel it like I am the caboose. No, Thomas the train, he can run a train on me. But I don't wanna alarm me. Fire alarm in my stove, it's hot. But I will smoke all of the pot. I smoke a pound a day, but I am not really that gay. Krispy Kreme. <laughs> Donuts in my yay. Donuts in my yay. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I'm featuring him with like Krispy Kreme. Yeah, mm. let's take you behind the scenes. Uh, drop a little bit of acid on your tongue, show you what it really means. Uh, I got pro exotic like Joe Exotic, yeah, I'm packing all that greens. Uh, I'm not even fucking bashing. I kill your fucking favorite homie, Carol Baskin, without no quack, uh, without asking. I do it with pure action. Mm, Doug, I'm never lacking. Uh, Zach, you got me laughing. Cause he's smoking cracking. Heroin. Zach's a heroin addict. Is that true? <laughs> is, that, is that on record? Uh, perfect. That was beautiful. That was terrible, okay. actually. Let's check. What do we have? For so viewer far. questions. There you go. What do we have for this viewer questions? It's actually perfect timing. This one will just do... Do we have any viewer questions this week? Yeah. Where are they? Um, hey, uh, viewers. <laughs> <laughs> Is there any... We actually have questions? a live studio audience right yeah, now. Yeah, we do have Which an actual great. audience right now. Because of COVID, it's kind of social distancing. There's only two of them, but like, I as mean, soon as this all blows over, These two be more. kiss each other goodnight, so... What do you mean? We kiss, you kiss us, and we kiss you goodnight, too. It's homie. He, he wants us to that's, wants that, that, that's not true, bro. That's not true, bro. Really <laughs> shut the fuck up. Oh, uh, first question from our viewers. <laughs> Is kissing your homies goodnight gay? Uh, no. No. As long as you, you, you don't make eye contact. No, kiss, well, kissing your homies goodnight is not gay. I thought kissing anybody anywhere is just weird, unless, well, actually, no. Wait, if, if, you, if you serious? Want it, are you serious? Yeah. Fucking is straight, like kissing kiss. is gay. Everybody knows that. 
Wait, kissing kissing if you want it to be gay, then so it's gay and it's cool like, because like, I'm a kiss that's virgin. Cool. I never kissed but anyone. But you can also just like platonically kiss your homies goodnight, yeah. and it means well. Like I don't know, Reese has kissed me goodnight a whole bunch of times. But I've only kissed my. Pillow. I've been too drunk or whatever, and just need to chill. He's he, he you know he, he's great. <laughs> Wait, what? Zach, Zach, oh, not so good. He's got mean? rough lips, but yeah, I, I take lips. it anyway. You know, it's not kissing each other they're without textured. Textured. You want it to be. They're textured. Okay. I'm kind of, I'm kind of upset now. Because we kiss you when you're kiss you all. You guys kiss me when I'm asleep? Yeah. Have you ever gone and kissed goodnight by your homies? I do. Always. Oh, I never much. have. I kiss all my homies goodnight. No one ever kisses me goodnight. No, you don't. Yeah, we can't do it as good I've as I've kissed you. your forehead so many times. It's kind of intimidating to think about kissing yeah. you goodnight. It's like... <laughs> Because you're just what are we gonna get? I'm just dude, you the got, of you got so much right oil now. on your skin, dude. Our no, yeah. Yeah. You have, you have Am I gonna be pizza? Layer. Am I gonna turn into pizza? <laughs> I'm sorry, pizza. I'd rather be coconut rather than pizza greasy Reese. Pizza greasy Reese. Greasy, greasy. Greasy. Uh, next greasy. question from the viewers. Any other questions? <laughs> That's it. That's it. <laughs> All right. We don't have that. There's more questions. Thank you probably. for having me. I'm gonna go uh, nap and masturbate in your bathroom. Cool. See you guys. Good luck with the whole. That, that, uh, good luck with the whole. You can just human trafficking thing. Okay. All right, call me. That's not the boss. <laughs> CIA is definitely not listening. That's the boss. Boss. Yeah, yeah, you're, get the it. Yeah, you're on the wrong podcast. Dude. You're on the wrong one, dude. Don't go, go. Take him out. Don't All right, dude. Thanks for having a clear walkway. Are you just you spent you just leaving the podcast? You just We've it. never had a guest walk out on us. And we yeah. also just like never had a guest, so this is like one for one right now. Yeah, you about to. What are you doing? <laughs> you can't see you right now, Stormy. What are you? What, why are you? Are you where where am I going? Away. Oh, no. oh, no. I guess now that we don't have our guest, and Reese is passed out on the floor with his dog. I'm chilling with. The Even if it's early, this here. would be a good time to call it. So it seems like a natural. The natural end of the, of the story. cycle. Yeah. It's a domino. And the moral of the story is that thank you to not only Anchor, but whoever else has sponsored this podcast. And thank you for tuning in to Boss Bus Between Two Cheeks, Volume 2. Good night. Good night. Farewell. Sweet Drive dreams. safe. Sweet dreams. And, you know, live a good one. Right. No closing credits? There's kind of, no, I, can, I can read out. We don't, eight, we don't have questions. Lewis from Tennessee said, "What did Lewis from Tennessee say?" We want to know. Finally, now, Yeah, we can go to the next Thank you for submitting your question, Lewis. I don't quite know how to answer that. Thanks, Lewis. Uh, uh, yep, that's uh, yep, that's it. That's a wrap. Awesome. Gotta pee.